Making more pasta. This time we're going with, or oh, what are we doing? Do you want to do the fettuccine again? Yeah. Or did we do the, you want me to do the angel here? I don't know. I mean, we're doing chicken parmesan, so it's your call. It's just a side dish, basically. Yeah. I guess we can do the angel here, because I guess we did do the fettuccine last uh -huh. time. Dough actually looks better. She worked it pretty damned hard because uh, she forgot to put the water in it. <laughs> oh, yeah. So she had to work it pretty hard. So there's no water in it whatsoever. It's just egg, flour, a little bit of olive oil. And salt. Uh, yeah, a pinch of salt or so. Yay. go freaking little beautiful perfect pile of pasta I'm wowzer more pasta this time. there's the final product the it's product we this is actually like tagalatini it's not angel hair but it's delicious <laughs> I made cool. that myself oh my god how you looking at them giant heads? Hey, yeah, yeah. There's my delicious tomato sauce, completely from scratch. As in, I roasted and squished those tomatoes with my bare hands. There's some peppers from the garden in there too. Tomatoes and peppers, yay. You guys figured out what we're making yet? Have I even told you what we're making yet? Chicken Parmesan. Those are little breaded chicken cutlets that I butterflied myself. I got two different kinds of cheese. The sauce, obviously, you're gonna brown them off. And then you already saw the pasta. That's gonna be our side dish. That's a pretty breast. Yeah. Yeah, I said it. So there, I forgot to show the sauce as it went on the chicken, but the sauce is underneath. All that delicious cheese. That's Monterey Jack and Rosemary Parmesan. Actually, Asiago. Asiago. And now I'm going to bake it for about 15 minutes at yeah, 400 until it browns up deliciously, wonderfully. There's the final product. Actually, I'm going to put a little sprinkle of Parmesan cheese on top because I have just a little nubbins left. Yummy.